Hi guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show how to make website or YouTube channel animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, after the finished video, I will share project files for download. So first, let's create new conversation. Go to click this icon and add the name web and size full hd time duration 10 second click ok then select this video move to inside our conversation ok then let's change quality full go to shape layers hold this icon and i will make mask let's masking like this ok let's see let's cut like this ok and close audio so in this time let's right mouse go to precoms add the name channel and select this for move to all in the new conversation click here adjust main conversation and click ok so let's go to this icon for select region of interest let's select region like this Go to composition and click crop come to region of interest. Okay, let's back to web and press S, change scale. Okay, and in this time go to shape layers and let's go to full screen. Make one shape like this. Okay, clearization tool and in this time select this shape layer, move to behind channel. Okay, change name, channel, background. So in this time, let's right mouse, go to composition settings and click to read render, change render, cinema 4D, click OK. Then select the shape layer and composition, click this icon for to read the layers. Okay, so let's go to view and change active camera to top. Select the channel background, let's open inside, extrusion deep, 10 or change 50 okay so select the channel and let's see okay that's all let's change view custom view 1 okay let's change this custom view 2 or custom view 3 okay not bad let's select this and Move to left a little bit. Okay, that's good. So in this time, select this channel conversation. Let's link to channel background. And change view active camera. And select this channel background. Let's press air for open rotation. And select the channel conversation. Let's move to left. Okay, change quality quarter. And go to first second. Let's make year rotation and change rotation like this. Okay, and go to two seconds. Change rotation like this. Let's see. Okay, not bad. So in this time, let's select three frames, make easies. Let's see. Okay, and go to 6 seconds. Let's press N for select work area. And change rotation like this. Okay, let's change a little bit rotation like this. And go to last keyframe for chain rotation slowly keyframes let's see okay so in this time let's select this keyframe hold control and left mouse click then select this keyframe again right mouse go to keyframe ascent and select easy ease in not easy ease select this go to graph editor we can see here keyframe for slow rotation and smooth transition here 
with these two keyframes. Let's see. Nice. So in this time, let's back to keyframes and go to here. Let's chain rotation like this and this rotation. Okay, and right now let's make X rotation and Z rotation. Go to first keyframes and change this like this. Let's see. Select these keyframes, make easies, and these keyframes make easies. Okay, nice. So select this channel background again. Let's hold shift press P and go to here, make new passing keyframe and move to right and move to up a little bit and go to here first second and let's move to left like this and select keyframes, make easy go to graph editor and let's select this graph, make smooth animation. Let's see. Okay, let's back to keyframes. And in this time, let's change X rotation 10. Let's see. So let's select this year rotation and change minus 150 let's see okay not bad and let's select these year rotation keyframes go to graph editor let's make graph like this okay not bad back to keyframes select these two rotation keyframes Z rotation and Y rotation. Go to graph editor again. Select these graphs. Let's make like this. Okay, not bad. So back to keyframes and select this channel background. Go to fill color. Let's select yellow. Or let's open stroke color. Select this color code. Control C and select fill color control v okay and let's select this channel again go to stroke color change to dark red for shadow okay we can see here shadow color and background color nice So in this time, let's go to text and let's write here YouTube channel, Clicization tool and let's select this text layer, right mouse, go to create and create shapes from text. Select text and delete, select this shape layer and I want to move the anchor point center. For this, hold control, double click, palm behind icon. Okay, Clicization tool. Okay, click here for 3D layer. Open inside. Geometry options. Change extrusion deep 50. Okay, go to view. Select one. Let's see. Okay, select this shape layer. Change stroke. Go to here. Select this red color. And change to dark for shadow. Let's see. Okay, nice. Back to again camera view. So in this time, let's select the shape layer and let's press P and make new passing keyframe. Go to first second and let's move to here. And let's select keyframes, make easies. Go to graph editor, select this graph, let's make graph like this, let's see. Let's select this shape layer, go to solo.
Okay, let's say again. So let's back to shape frames and go to here, select the shape layer, hold shift press R and make year rotation. Move to here and change this 25. Let's see. Okay, let's try change like this. Okay, and here make X rotation and Z rotation. Let's go to here, change rotation like this and like this and move to left first shape frames. Let's say again. Okay, not bad. Select these rotation shape frames and let's make easy. Okay, that's good. So let's unsolo and select this shape layer, move right. Okay, first scene and second scene. Nice. And let's create new background, right mouse, new and solid. Add name background, select color white like this, click OK, click OK again, move to behind. OK, not bad. OK, let's say again. Nice, not bad. So let's select this channel composition, go to FX Presser, search FX Sweep and let's use CC light sweep, let's use for this channel composition and let's go to solo okay and here let's change light like this and let's change width here and light color yellow or red or blue Click OK, change edge. OK, and move to right here. Let's see. OK, in this time, make new center keyframe and go to here, go to last second and move it down like this. Let's see. Okay, that's good. Let's unsolo. Okay, let's see. Nice, not bad. So, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.